So here we are back again with another Days Gone reaction video. We've had a few, but this is a story trailer release. Uh, have we actually got a release date of the game? I don't. I don't want to spoil too much. I don't. I don't think we do, do we? It must be soon if we're getting all these trailers and details on the game. I'm gonna have to have a look. Hold on. Sooner than I thought. Didn't even think we had a release date. What do we not have a release date? Cyberpunk. That's what we don't have a release date for. But Days Gone, we certainly do. 26th of April. Exciting stuff. Uh, it's got some games to compete with this year. It's got obviously uh, the PlayStation exclusive Last of Us 2. Obviously that's a, that's you know that's on a different caliber, if I'm honest. But this looks good. The protagonists on these PlayStation exclusives are always very good. Uh, Kratos from God of War. The um, the Last of Us cast. Yes, I forgot their names. Doesn't matter. Those guys. Um, <laughs> but days gone. We follow Deacon. Uh, who's like an ex-biker? Probably, no, probably is still a biker. Uh, he's probably ex due to his situation of the apocalypse and stuff. But uh, anyway, let's get right into this, guys. Nice little two minute fifteen. So let's go. You know, we never talked about it while we still wore the colors. this time out in the freak show when shit like this didn't matter anymore. And we wrote out a farewell without Sarah. I knew that we were leaving everything behind. What did you do? Everything that mattered was gone. Hmm. Folks here in a lot of pain, Deke. You find his stash. You bring it to me. To me, Dick. You do that. We'll see what we can do for you. Dick, Dick, bro, bro. And I know what kind of man he is. What he's done. He done any worse than you? Ricky? How about me? Oh, wow. You're afraid to be here. You're afraid to be a part of something. We need you here, and that scares the hell out of you. We have to look out for each other. It's all we've got. You could have saved a few lives. There was no hope, there was no time, there was no room, okay? That was, we'd already turned on each other by the time the hordes arrived. What? Hope you're right about your old lady, Deke. Oh crap, you see that bat? What does it matter if everyone else is dead? Holy shit. Well. That's good. That looks good. Day's gone. You've done it again, man. These trailers are awesome. There's so much going on there as well. So many new faces that we haven't seen. So much. There's more to it. There's like more, I don't know story behind obviously it's a story trailer but there's just so much more stuff to get your teeth into it looks good it looks really oh, i like it i like it. i'm excited to play it i mean look he's got a fucking crossbow he had the bat with the blade on like the razor blade so obviously you can probably customize a lot of your weaponry which is good that brings some depth and um player choice to it which is cool uh, i haven't seen a change of clothes maybe you can't change that I know it is open world um, I know maybe maybe you can maybe you can maybe you get to customize your rings and tattoos and stuff that would be sweet but um, very cool looking game it'll be good to see how big the world is once we get into it I think the big part of this game is the fact that the way the hordes work is insane you just have these mass swarms of hordes of zombies or infected or whatever they're called um, which is different. I don't think we've had a game with that kind of horde swarm infected vibe. I know Daisy is meant to be a game coming with that uh, kind of thing going on, but in this game, I think it's going to be the first to bring it out. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, please. At least in that caliber and tri triple A, I guess. 
So I guess this is a triple A, I would say it is, but it looks good. Let me know in the comments what you think. Are you excited to play as this bounty hunter badass deacon? I know I am. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Been a pleasure as always. Do leave a like, do subscribe, leave a comment as to what you think. I love to read your comments. They make my day, you know, they just make it. But thank you very much for watching once again, guys. It's been Zell, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.